Here's how you can pull off this experiment where you get a can of Coke to sink in one container of water and float in another container of water. The trick is actually very simple. The water over here is at 37 degrees Celsius, so I had to warm it a little bit. The water over here is at room temperature, 23 degrees Celsius. And because the density of water changes with temperature, it actually gets more dense as you cool it to a point. This water is more dense than the Coca-Cola can, whereas this water is less dense than the Coca-Cola can. So the Coke can over here is going to sink. Now what's interesting to note is not every single can of Coca-Cola behaves in this manner. Usually they all are going to sink in warm water, but not all of them are going to sink in room temperature water. And I think that's because the whole Coca-Cola can assembly is really close to the density of water. And so it's very sensitive to temperature changes in the water. So we can see that this can over here is going to float because this can assembly is less dense than the surrounding cool water, whereas this can is still more dense than the surrounding cool water. We'll just try a few more over here just to see. I find about 10 to 20 percent of the cans are able to float in the cooler water.